We've got Chad Morris, the manager of the Jersey Women's FA team going into these Island Games. Chad, your first time in charge. How excited are you about the prospect of leaving this group of girls going to Guernsey? Yeah, really excited and confident with this group. There's a perfect blend of um, experience and upcoming young players. I did uh, Gotland in 2017, so I know what's coming as regards intensity and that intensity and the volume of games means we're going to have to use the 18-man uh, squad. who have certainly all earned their places and good enough to compete in every game. And we heard from the skipper Libby that there's going to be a need for that squad. There's three games in three days to kick off the tournament. Which I'm sure is illegal nowadays, in all fairness. But yeah, and it's, uh, I don't know whether Libby said, it's a half two kickoff and then straight into a half, t uh, half ten in the morning of the next one. So yeah, we've said to them that there's starting players and there's impact players because you're going to need all 18. So there's no one on the bench, there's no sub. Everyone's got to be ready to come on and play a part. And how well has that mix of the youth and the, the older players worked for you leading this squad forward? Yeah, good, because they're, they're not just experienced players, they're experienced players and they're good people as well. So they help the younger players through, particularly when it gets tense, like it will. They're the ones that use their experience from games before and help the girls through it. And looking at the opponents, we've got Bermuda, Aland and Hitra. Any info on them? So Bermuda, We've just been looking at, we've seen some YouTube stuff of them. They played a friendly last night, so we're just trying to trawl through that Instagram. They played um, Bournemouth, so I've actually been on to the Bournemouth manager to try and get more info out of him. So we'll take what we can from them. And like we just said to the girls there, it's worry about Bermuda first, and then worry about Orland and Hitra after. Um, Hitra and Orland play the same time as us on Sunday, so we've got a video at that. So that'll get recorded, so it'll be a rush to do our game get recovery and then go through that video ready for the all-in game at half ten. And looking forward to say, a week time, what would be the ultimate success for you for this group of girls? Well, the ultimate success is going to be gold, isn't it? But uh, second to that is performance. If they can all perform to their best and every single one of them can look at themselves in the mirror being happy with their performances. Well, we wish you well. Good Thank you, sir. Guaranteed. Thanks, mate.